Patrick. Yes. Yes, uh, Matthew. You have told me that this is worse than down. If you remember the downcoming play, the, the downcoming. Down coming. Yes, my favorite thing is downcoming. Uh, no, if you remember the downpour playthrough. I don't. Which often one is that? Times Which one is we that? will go through some horrible segment, and I will go. Well, fuck, at least it's not as bad as fucking Homecoming. Let's that start fucking homecoming, piece of then. shit. This, uh. is, this is the moment that Simon Hill died and Downpour is just like, wow, 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 wow. 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 That's the moment that Silent Hill just died, and then uh, after so Silent Hill Zero was kind of bad, but it was fine, fine. I guess. Silent Hill Four was kind of bad, but it was fine. Shattered Memories I thought was pretty good, but it was super weird, not like a Silent Hill game. Uh, but this awesome game, about. this game is just this outrageous crock of fucking shit. Yeah, if you remember uh, when this game was first announced, it was called I believe Silent. It was it was released 5. as it was originally announced as Silent Hill Five is being developed by who made this? Double Helix. Double Helix by Double Helix. And everyone, oh my god, this is gonna be the worst. And then uh, at some point, it just changed from Silent Hill Five into Homecoming. And then when people saw that, they're like, okay, they're like, they okay, know. well, this they is know. doomed. This they is doomed. Know. Actually, we happen to. No, people who worked on Homecoming. I know a few. People who worked alongside the development staff, and we actually have a few choice quotes from them regarding the subject. Quote, The entire development process can be summed up in the action of renaming it. They strutted in the room cocksure with brass balls, shouting, Silent Hill 5, motherfucker! Stopped, opened their eyeballs, and immediately whimpered back out the door, flaccid, whispering, Homecoming. <laughs> It doesn't inspire confidence. I don't like it. Just Great. This loading screen doesn't... <laughs> so, right off the bat, I should mention, this came out really closely after uh, Silent Hill, the movie. Yeah. And as a real symbol of quality, we see that the subtitles in this game mean closed captioning. Oh, because God, we saw the, the word worst. sound and airplane things and explosions. That's the worst. It's I hate that. So, right off the bat, I'm gonna talk that Silent Hill is a long-running horror franchise with many movie inspirations for the first and second games, what particularly... Kindergarten Cop. Kindergarten Cop, but also the works of Stephen King, such as uh, The Fog, uh, Rosemary's Baby, and the movie Jacob's Ladder. Right, Jacob's Ladder. Uh, Jacob's Ladder being a really fucking freak-ass movie. That they are stealing this scene directly from. It does seem familiar. Every game they said, we're not going to do Silent Hill 2 again. We're not going to do it again. You know so in this one they said, fuck it, we're just going to steal Jacob Ladder's plot entirely. Because fuck it, we have no ideas. It'll be cool. I see. So, you have no experience with Homecoming at all? No. I don't like this game. All I know is that I saw those couple of first screen. Is there a pipe just Wait. clipping through his texture? That's just, That's the flashlight. That's his flashlight, right? That's the classic L-shaped flashlight. It looks terrible. Like it looks this. awful. Yeah, camera angle. There's one cool visual thing this game does. Hey kids, do you, did you notice that this guy might have been in the military? Well, yeah, he was like, where's my squad? And there was explosions. Also, did you have to look at the gigantic dog tags on his chest? Uh-oh. Oh, oh no! It's a giant cleaver. Oh no! It's Doctor Nick Riviera. Just so the got very killed. first thing you do in a Silent Hill game is do quick time events. Hi everybody! And the quick time events are shown to you in giant, bright Xbox like certified I don't versions know. of the prompts. I don't know about you, but those prompts are pretty scary. All right. All right. So Matt, you're behind the controls here. As long as throw is an RB, I'm Throw fine. is in fact not a function is, in this is, game. It, no, it, You can turn on your flashlight right. and radio if you were to go into your options and hit those buttons. What was that? Was, was the run prompt? Uh, yeah. I, I missed it. I don't know. I, I don't think know. you just run in this game. You don't like want to turn your flashlight on at all? How did you do this? You hit RB and then you did the thing for flashlight. That's Possibly. a really clumsy way to turn on your flashlight. Well, there's one thing I will give this game over downpour, and that's the fact that the frame rate is solid. <laughs> Which actually kind of a big deal. In and a horror game, it's not. 
It's a big deal for the frame rate to be solid. But sometimes it could be so bad, the frame rate, that it makes it look like they're having scary ghost walks. Well, sometimes they do have scary ghost walks. Well, you know, you can have the frame rate help out in that regard. No, 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 no. All right. So there's blood. There's blood. That's pretty scary. Hey, kids, that. what's a scary environment? Hospitals. Oh, look at this. Look at this sauna. That's an iron lung, man. No, it's a sauna. No, look, he says it's an iron lung. Which is a, another way of saying sauna. You don't know what sauna is. It's a PT cruiser. Saunas are those things that old Swedish men go into to let their dicks breathe. You seem to know a lot That's about it. That's what a sauna it. is! You seem to know a lot about it. I know enough. Josh. Wow, this reminds me a lot of Downpour because you were looking through the kid and through the Really? Bars. Are you telling me that Downpour might have stolen ideas from a common thread within Sauna Hill? The horror franchises. Hey kid. Hey kid. How many games do we have to go through that rip off the concept of there's a kid and they're ignoring you, but they're drawing or reading or yeah, doodling or playing piano or numbers? We got numbers around. You need to keep exploring, man, for numbers. Look, there you did it. So these are important. Over here. Ra room two hundred five patient. Went missing and shit, but no. Less to the that's, best. That, that's too. That's that's enough plot for you now. A uh, two o five, nothing. Let's even though you may you may already know. Let's just put two o. I don't do. I haven't played this game since it came out. All right. Well, there's that's no not enter it. Button. So maybe uh, you could go through any of those doors. Off. Maybe I'm just, just investigating. Explore, you stupid idiot. I just literally was. Don't, don't be like this. I'm gonna be like this! Just because you're so angry that no one cares about this franchise anymore. Wow, does no one care? So then you search the scraps of the Maybe you look, you should look at four. it. But you I need the rest it. of it, man. Didn't we do this exact puzzle in another game? Yes. <laughs> uh, so, what this is, you saw that guy get cut in half, right, by the cleaver. It looked like it. And it was super brutal. Who so has now a you're, cleaver? Now you're looking at... The sternum thing, which is also cut Even in half. Too. Yes. Fine. Yes. Fine. I do like that this game has the very classic Sonic Hill map system. It's very classic. Uh, Downpour got away from that with the the every door is locked scenario, but I kind of liked it. I kind of liked that every down. just like eh, it's locked. Something horrible's probably in there. Yes, Matt, that's a dead body. Put a lot of dead bodies. Yeah, because it's an evil hospital. And babies. Baby's crying. Another sauna. Like, it's kind of amazing how this just looks like a version of Silent Hill that was just made poorly. <laughs> like, you took everything, you're like, oh, it's Silent Hill, right? And you're like, no. You have to do it good, though, actually. Vitamins. No, you got a health drink. Vitamins. I don't know what the health drinks are. Health like, drinks. they were, you no, know, but they were implied to be, like, some kind of, like, Tonic or like energy drink or something. Ugh, I don't like this jump through animation. It's, it's very actiony. <laughs> oh, you didn't know your character's a soldier. He's a soldier. Take it. Take it, you idiot. Okay, it's black and useless. No, but you go put it on the other thing and it'll be great. Alright. It'll be fantastic. I assume I need one more, but maybe not. I don't know, man. It's been too long. I don't, it's been too long. I basically don't even play video games anymore. I, I just the, do this shit all day. I fucked the pain away long ago. God. Now you're just numb. So numb. Who the fuck would take their baby to a theater like this? Who the fuck just leaves... Well... Eh, that's creepy. Uh, oh, oh I, look! I completely missed the Oh, scare, you completely so missed the stinger! Maybe they shouldn't have put the trigger so far fucking back. Or no, the, the sound was actually placed behind you, so the idea is that you're gonna come forward and see the body and go, ah! I love how ah! the shadow is scarier than the body. Yeah, that's how shadows are, man. Shadows I remember when I was like eight years old, there was a weird shadow coming through my blinds and scared the fucking shit out of me. You skipped work that day. Yeah, when I was eight, I skipped work! Yep. You don't have any weapons. Alright, so... Something is... Next. What about inventory? I just pressed inventory. But where's the... There's nothing, there's just weapons. Where's the, the, the thing you picked up? Oh, it's LB. There it is. Nice. That's Wait, the RB is right. for... LB is inventory and then RB what's RB is we weapons. Okay, that makes sense. So now, 
There, six now you two, know it. 624-872. I'm not going to write it down, because fuck that. 624-872. 624-872. 624-872. 624-872. You want to clear that. I want to clear it. You want to clear it. 624-872. Did you do it? I did it. Good for you, man. One of those kids will just disappear and run away. Gosh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck off, kid! You are a stupid dick. Hey kids, if you're out there and you have kids, just leave. Wow, I never I never noticed when I was playing it, but that giant like autosave symbol in the fucking upper left is super awful. Thanks. It's pigs! It's fucking terrible drawing. I could draw better than that. You could. I probably can't. Josh! Stop! Josh, don't run into that obvious save point! Little Oh, car garbage. Eh. Oh, uh, we don't really want to make a great texture. No, just fuck up the mirror some. Just fuck it up. Oh. Uh, this whole thing is just so on the nose. It's just so, like... Horror. 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 Look, look, it's horror. Horror. Did you see the horror? Did you see there's a dead guy in that bathroom stall? Fuck! What a Fucked up world! You might as well just turn off your console, because it's so scary. Like all the other classic ones built up the hospital. Hospital's either the second or the third level. When you learned that you had to go to a hospital, you're like, I don't want to go to that hospital. Right! It was like, you have to go to Brookhaven. Or you have to go to Alcamelia. Like, I don't want to go to a fucking hospital! This, that shit's the worst! It's not great. Now, like, this game overdid hospitals so much with its first level, the downpour just said, fuck it, we can't do hospitals. Nope. There's no hospitals I in I think town. I remember asking... <laughs> I think I remember asking you, is there a hospital in this? You were like, no. No. Why? Because they ruined it. This is Nothing. fucking dead to me now. Look, now you got a sick knife. It's so big and glowing. People freak their shit over, like, the Deus Ex glowing prompts. Yeah. But this shit's out of control. The Deus Ex ones at least would have that. So this is the one cool visual thing in the entire game, is they ripped off the movie effect and have the bleeding textures. Right, right, right. Which... They did once in Silent Hill 1. They're... Isn't this the only reason they got this job? Because yes, because they showed this <laughs> exact room to the developers, and they were like, fuck. Why a nurse in the hot end right now? Well... Because the most iconic Silent Hill villain should be the very first enemy you kill in the game. So that you know that you're playing Silent Hill. Now quick, use Zelda combat to beat this thing up. Is she gonna break out of the blocks to hit stun? Okay, or? Matt, let me ask you. Did you feel scared? I felt more aroused than scared. That's the issue. <laughs> This is, is the, the issue. issue you have, the whole man. time you're playing Homecoming and you're like, Josh, you just got this huge just, erection ready to go. Okay. Okay. Nothing? You got nothing, lady? Nothing. nothing. There's that other door, though. Fuck. I'm just saying. Just all rust. Everyone. Oh, Next right. Light. No, there's no Thanks other door there. Help. I think you, you crawl through the stall that she was in. Yeah. Yeah, yeah there you go. Squeeze through. And fuck oh. this game. <laughs> and fuck this game. Just, I hate it so much. Hey, it has a Silent Hill sound effect when you pick something up, though. Yeah, the one thing that's unquestionably really good about this game is the music, because it was done by Akira Yamaoka, yeah. uh, who did all the music for everything except for Downpour, and who I guess I'm gonna partially blame Can't for really. Silent Hill going to shit. There's some bad responsibility like, has to be on him. I'm not gonna say that it's like he should have turned down the work because the dude needed to eat. He worked for Konami. A lot of people need to eat. But I'm saying that like his music being in all these uh, games, oh god, like kind of endorses them. How many wheelchairs were there in Downpour? Like a million? Well, because wheelchairs were part of the theme. The doctors say that I'm unable to discern fantasy from reality. I saw- that's fucking bullshit. I saw those demons! They were killing everyone! One was Pyramid Head! James told me about it! <laughs> My friend James! You know- James Sunderland! You know that cool guy! Uh, I appreciate the noise effects. Yeah, that's good. Better say. than the HD collection! Oh, and your radio's going off. I feel like starting with the yeah, radio and the right flashlight. There, so I'm just gonna slash the shit. Yeah, slash your shit. There. 
Use your combos. Okay. Now there are more than one, but don't worry. Well, what, do I have like a dodge? Yes, you do. I think it's B. Yes. Okay. There, you dodge attacks. So you don't really need to dodge as long as Well, not these it. ones. Later Battery, you will. Yeah, okay. Yes. Very scary. Ha! Very, ha! very scary. I'll watch TV. No. Uh, it'd be really great to have, like, creepy, uh... Oh. Oh, look, it's a dead guy. I guess I shouldn't have come on to those sexy nurses. So sexy. I do appreciate the patch on his arm, but... Yeah, the like the, the soldier's jacket. It's cool. I, I just came back from... That looks kind of like skin. Yeah, I it's skin. It's got the flesh wall. Scary. Look, it's got gross yeah, teeth. It's got teeth in it, too. This feels like they thought Silent Hill was more like a heavy metal album album cover than like dark Baphomet based like evil. Now don't get us wrong, a lot of games should be like the heavy metal album covers. But yeah, not this yeah, I'll agree with that. Thanks. Uh, yes. That's that's gonna be annoying. It really. She's not here. Okay. Well. Shit ain't here. She's not. It's not here. If you thought it was here. I you went through the vagina I came wall. to this mental hospital because I thought there'd be sick, hot chicks. There yeah, are. It's you know, worth a shot. Better than the bar scene. Mm-hmm. I'll tell you that. What the free. fuck is that? That creep. Oh, that's... Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Occasional parts of interesting visual design. But uh, the main issue is that it's all stolen from the movie. Like, the movie was doing Silent Hill 1 and 3 kind of visuals, right? Right, right. And then this is just like, no, I'll just steal that. Now... Remember those big bugs from the movie? That had big, stupid faces? They really should have just called this the movie game. <laughs> oh, well, no! They could have called it Silent Hill the movie. The game. They should have. They really should have. No, but they couldn't, like, call it that. Why not? They should have called the move. They should have quick called. fight them. Really? Yes. Oh, okay. See? That's not scary. Isn't it? it, it Aren't you, you scared? You're just playing Man vs. Wild. You're way scarier than this. Ah! <laughs> uh, yes, I get it. The same body. The exact same body. Hey, you gotta reuse it. Gotta reuse Next it. Next gen too. development is expensive. All right. Or current gen it's that whole fucking terminology's gotten so backwards. Where the current gen is next gen, and people are referring to next gen as next next gen. This looks so next gen. It it looked fine at the time. Josh was Robbie the Rabbit doll stuffed in his backpack. Now you Robbie, get the, it? Robbie the Rabbit is a fucking dirt ass motherfucker. He's not great. Son of Hill, he's a dick. He's in three and four. And he's just a creepy, blood-stained rabbit. That's it. There's nothing That's more to job. him. job. Like, he punches in every day. It's like, Robbie, you want to blood-stain this shit? And... Wow, this this looks great right here. It, I do all like the it. filter and all of that. Yeah, sure. Noise filter the shit out of it. Yeah, but look, with the light especially. Yeah. But... Just you know, cake it on. Fuck's all this shit. Less quality than a New Vegas mod. <laughs> what is it? Uh, Cinema Tech? Something. Well, well, great. Good job, Matt. Now you have this pseudo mini encounter boss fight with these nurses as they clip into one another as you they die. Judge. You can judge. Wow. So I should ex. Uh, so there's the guy cut in half, as oh, wow. we saw in the intro. They carried him quite a distance. As we saw in the intro and we saw in the puzzle. But what they said coming up into this game was like, Silent Hill combat is terrible. And everyone went, yes. Yeah, Silent Hill 1 through 4's combat was awful. Same thing with Origins, same thing with Shattered Memories. That's why they took it out of Shattered Memories. <laughs> right? They said, fuck it. That's why Climax just, ah, take it out. So it said, we're going to make the game about a soldier, and then the soldier will have a good excuse to fight enemies. Right. Um... And people said, you can't make the fighting good, though. Well, because if the fighting is good, then it trivializes every single scary monster because you want to run from all of them. They're like, no, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. But, but no, though. And as you see from your rock-solid first encounter... Uh, I want it? everyone to just take a note of that mm -hmm. character model because we'll be seeing it again later. A lot? Yeah. Uh, that particular model, and that it is cut in half. 
Oh, that's all I'll say for now. Alrighty. That's uh, all I'll listen to. Ooh. Ooh, tough guy here. Alright. You got the key. You can escape this dumb hospital. It's the door behind you. Yeah. I, I, you know... Yes, thank you. This is something I really missed from Downpour, and it's not done well here, but it is here, and it's the static images of puzzle things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which I really like. Like, Downpour kind of did it, yes. but it was done really poorly. You just yes. want to use the open the door button to just bust through. Like, L like you're a fucking badass. The super... What? Alright, everything's just falling. Okay. Yeah, everything's just falling. Sending so the electric shock machine beyond the seizure threshold yielding impressive results. Brother. Most violent presence, patients are docile. The only side effects have been memory loss, dislocated bones, a fractured leg, and a patient bit off their tongue. Mm. So I actually happen to know a lot about electroshock therapy. You uh, seem to have a, a, a memory bank of a lot of weird stuff. Well, I you. went to school for psychology. <laughs> right. So the deal about electroshock is they used to use it for everybody. For everything. I got a cold. Um, and it, you know, you, they would put you on it and they would shock you so bad that you would seize so hard you would break your arms and legs. Right. And they're like, this is helping them. They are getting better. Uh, what they find out now that Joshua, electroshock that actually helps with, like, depression. Busy. Right. If you do it what? under the seizure threshold. What are you doing here? And that it actually works. I want my toy. It's like Mass Effect. How did you get here? Someone brought me here. They told me Robin You really here. like that rabbit. Okay, how old is that kid? Like, ten? Ten, eight. Is he too old to be, like, I want my fucking rabbit? Well, he's drawing lots of- I want my toy. Fuck you. Fuck you, kid. Toys around here. Guess you're not my friend. Can you feel- Oh, fuck off! Can you feel the- the personality from these characters? I really don't like that we haven't had a good look at his face. It's the been kid? No, th this guy that we are, Alex? Al well, we don't know that he's Alex, but he's Alex. Uh, but, like, his face has been masked by shadows Well, so just far. turn around. Spin the camera. Oh, it's one of those situations where you can't quite statically turn the camera? No, okay. Well, find Robbie then, I guess. You know how Harry Mason... Stuffed in the cleavage of Remember nurse. how Harry Mason was brought to life through that cool CG trailer, like the Silent Hill 1 starts with, and right. then he has an interesting voice and cadence. Where are the stupid kids go? And how James Sunderland has that cool scene in the bathroom of Silent Hill 2, and then he has a monologue to himself about finding his dead wife. Right. And then Heather has that cool talk with Douglas, and she's all like, like a whiny teenager and mm -hmm. shit. What does Alex have? He's a cool combat guy. Really? Like, you fucking fight something before he utters his fifth line of dialogue. For fuck's sake. He's a soldier. Where's my squad? I need to get back to Delta Actual. Delta Echo 1-1. One one. Tuesday at... Robbie is stuck deep in the cleavage of a nurse. I, I must You know what? Robbie. I looked away from the screen, and now you have, like, completely flipped and turned around now. I have no idea where you are. You have a map, though. Right? Yeah, okay, fine. Just check all the doors. It's blue? Is that blue? That's, blue yeah, you're me. the blue arrow. So just go to the end of the hallway and check every single door. Great. It's the Silent Hill way. Just check doors. Ah, shit's locked. I can't open it. All the doors are on the right side. I believe you missed one. I'm just saying. Yeah, there you go. You just you just ran past know, it again. I'm just trying to see if there was another one. No, use your brain, Matt. That was easy. That's implausibly evil. Like it's in a mirror. That's pretty cool. Now there's a, a callback to Silent Hill two and three. We're already in this room. Where your elbow shoving into toilets, but instead of a toilet, it's just a blood wall. This reminds me of that trip to the doctor Willie had to go to. I don't even know how to... <laughs> I don't even know. Quick, quick oh, done with God. this. 
God, that is so, that that is a Xbox Live indie game prompt. It sure is. I wanted the toy. God, you're right. That's where I recognize that prompt. Mm -hmm. Xbox Live Indie Games has like the the generic Microsoft prompt. Oh, you may notice your uh, your radio is going off. Quick, dodge to remove the swarm. Where? It was on your face. Oh, that's lame. Uh, it's this way. Really, is it lame, Matt? Or is it the greatest thing you've ever played? Look, dodge it's on your to face again. The the swarm! And this is so terrible. Like, this is worse than I remembered. Like, how brutal is that? How often can you say a game is terrible, and then say, ah, it's not that, it can't be that bad. And yeah. you go back to it, it's worse. That never happens. But it's happening right now. Got your fucking toy, little pissant. Sh shove it through the yeah, bars, Shove Adam. it through the bars? Yeah. Duh. Stupid idiot. Take it! I got it! It's got tons of anal lube on it! You love it! <laughs> you love it, you stupid kid! I want Robbie. Look how fucking delayed the subtitle is! It's yours, you remember? <laughs> Go! Everything about that game! Take it, idiot. Oh my god, he looks hideous. He's not great. Come on. What a ghoul. And like... Come on, and kid. It is, it is not trolling to say that the PS2 character models no, look no. dramatically no. better no, than this. No, no, you're right. Like, anyone goes and finds that the video we did of Silent Hill 3 during the shitstorm where Douglas Gosh. is talking to Heather in Silent Hill 3 Gosh, looks amazing. Looks fucking great. I, 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 I get really annoyed when, like, a objective is presented to you and you complete it, but then, like, something like this... It's like, fuck off, it didn't matter, you it idiot. It didn't matter. It did not matter. Well, that's how you get scared. These, I don't want your shit drawing. You kid. want the shit drawing. <sighs> hey, guess what? But that was Do you reward. like that kid yet? No. Guess what that kid is? Your little brother? Yes, but he's also the primary objective of the entire game. Oh, God, he looks like... He looks like Jason. He does look like Jason. Or, what's the other one? Eth Eth oh, uh, Sean. Sean. Sean's the one that doesn't die. <laughs> Although, at, on one level, at the very least, you do get the, the typical, like, Akira Yamaoka drum stuff going in the background right now. So this is room 205. And despite being in the hospital, it has the same faint sound of like a dock or pier. Yeah. Okay. Nice. As you also saw earlier, 205 was the room of the, the particular patient Shit, that all these logs are talking about. Yeah. So it's time to push this button and escape through this elevator. Scroll button. This is a bit this is a little thing that drives me nuts, but he presses up on the elevator button. Like why? Because we were too lazy to make him press the downward button. Someone said, oh, he pushed the up button. Fuck it. He's going up. It doesn't matter. The scene... No, wait, now he's going down. What an asshole. What if someone was going up? People who in, do that are the... In this dead hospital? People who do that are the worst. Yeah, no, there, there's a special ring of hell. Dude, metal is... Sound! Scraping. Hey, come on. Calm down. It's a sound. Metal scraping. Shh, you can hear it. Oh my god, this is, this is gonna be the worst playthrough of all time. So, yeah. So I can tell that those are reused sound effects and from Silent Hill 2. It's also Pyramid Head dragging some shit. That is indeed Pyramid Head. We haven't seen him yet, but he's out there. Now, if any of you are going, Pat, fuck you for spoiling it. Fuck you for watching it. Oh my god, that was lame. It was a dream. Fuck this game. And look, Travis Brady, the greatest character of all time. Hero of Silent Hill Origins. You know, fuck it. I'm gonna come out and say it. Up until this point in time, Travis Brady is the single worst Silent Hill character to ever exist. That seems like a lot to say. If you played Silent Hill Zero, you would know. He is terrible. He's a total non-entity. He's a nobody. So why am I... Oh, You're going Shepherd's to Shepherd's Glen, Glen, where family comes where family first. Comes first. Yes. Oh. And now here is your your cinematic loading screen. It's perfect. It's a perfect time for a melee Hey, strike. I got another quote from our friend who worked on, uh, what's it called? What Homecoming. <laughs> what nugget of wisdom is this? This person did not know anything about Silent Hill. 
But, quote, even as a non-Silent Hill fan, but just a guy who had the deal explained to him, seeing Pyramid Head walking around the first three minutes was enraging. Now, let me put that on the plate here. Pyramid Head is James Sunderland's fucking monster. He's a personification of a single entity that... It's like the... It's like Jason from Friday the 13th was somebody's personal one-man boogeyman. Right? And they put him in here because he was in the fucking movie. Yeah. And they put him in the movie because they're like, well, we need a boogeyman. Yeah. And then in this game, they call him the boogeyman. No. Fuck! I don't believe you. They call him the boogeyman. Uh-oh. They call him the fucking boogeyman. No. But anyway, we're in My Shepherd's house. Glen, which is clearly just on the other side I of need Silent to Hill. Go home. Okay, wait a second, Matt. How many Silent Hill games did you play? To, uh, play them or complete them? Played at all. I, I played one, two, now I played three. Okay. I played four for like an hour. Okay. You, I, I only didn't can, play Oregon. Can you open up the map on here? So Toluca Lake. Is right in the there. upper right corner, right? Yeah. So the south side of Silent Hill is Silent Hill 2's resort area. The west side is the other half of Silent Hill 2's resort area. The north side is the old town and uh, the Alchemilia Hospital where Silent Hill Zero takes place. So where the fuck is Shepherd's Glen that it's also touching this fucking lake? I also noticed that Shepherd's Glen is 90% a cemetery. And also my house. <laughs> Think about it. Let's think of- look. Your house? <laughs> this is a map of a cemetery in your house in the town hall. Like, is he the mayor? Why does he get the biggest fucking house? Because his family founded Shepherd's Glen. Because his name is Alex Shepherd. Are you serious? I am dead serious. Oh my god. You know what, though? Just- I, let, as, let me just rub my temples <laughs> for a second. As much as I will shit on this game. And as much as I knew this game was going to be terrible, oh, there are some shining moments. That's cool. This is one of those shining moments well, this looks because this looks scary. dramatically better than anything in Downpour, and yeah. the music sets a tone that that works. How do these streets even work? I don't know, man. What's going on here? You, you're act back. yeah. And now the music's gone because oh. you took a little too long. Can't open it. No. But yeah, at least this looks like a foggy ass street. It looks pretty good. Granted, it doesn't make any sense that this area would be as foggy as Silent Hill because it's not Silent Hill and Silent Hill's that evil. The fog is really persistent. It's pretty good. It's got a nice solid line out about 30 feet in front of you. What happened in this place? It didn't used to be uh, like this! Isn't Silent Hill 4? Didn't you teleport to different Silent houses? Hill 4 really? takes place in. Judge Holloway. A nearby town whose name I can't remember. Judge Reinhold. Does your mother Judge know? Butterface. Didn't say Judge Early Gen Butterface. I haven't talked to her. Judge, we didn't bother texturing didn't it. Face. Judge Acceptable. Sticking around for long. Judge Mediocre. Well, Judge Good well, Enough. Judge Baked In Hair Model. <laughs> still here? That's that. I think we're done here. You know how it is. I talked to I talked to this uh, with Willie uh, Willy about um, in Predator Concrete Jungle. God damn it! Early on, uh, in this gen, it's no one is allowed to do women's hair. No one. You, women have short hair. It was a dream for Wooly early on in those those games, just, but just fapping all over the short hairs. But long hair, don't know. Tied in a bun. That's why. Short. That's why La Noir had all short hair because the face tech they used freaks out with long hair. To be fair, the style wise. Yeah, that's why it's set hair. in that era, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> L.A. Noir was supposed to be in the 80s. L.A. Noir is a game built around a very specific technological limit. Yeah. Uh, so we didn't learn any story there. She no, said, yeah. hey, you're back in town. And I wasn't paying attention to Despite either. the fact that he's like, hey, what's happening? Also, she's he's like, walking around with a knife. Right she's like, everything's her. fine. Shut up. That's really what she said? Shut your stupid mouth, Alex. What the fuck is going on? Things are crazy? No, shut no, up. No, that's not. They just small talked for bullshit. Right. Uh, My house. Yes, go to your house in the our middle of your street. In the middle of Shepherd's Glen. It's house. really out over to the side. God. 
This isn't like, what does he expect to happen? Like he's just driving down the street with a big fat knife. Shouldn't he be like, where are all the cars? Where are all the people? Well, he was like that. So if a uh, pyramid head is um, uh, James uh, James's J thing, yes. Who is Pyramid Girl's thing? Pyramid Girl? Yeah. It's mine, I guess. Triangle Girl. Triangle Girl, that's her name. Yeah. She's not real, man. We made her up. I don't know. And then know. Plagues brought her to life. Yeah, I know. So it's Plagues' thing. It's like the mouth of madness. Like, once you write it, it's gonna it's gonna appear real. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So this is My your big, house. dumb, evil house. Looks pretty evil. And the fog near the top of the building looks great. It's just going over the... Yeah, it looks great. God. It's like... There's like, you know, there's a couple. Th I can't wait to play not it. Not absolutely everything in this game is terrible, but damn, there's this a lot. This loading screen sure does. That looks like a good monster right there. Look at that. Just Lots a, of thought put into it's it. Just a penis with legs. Yeah, that's basically everything in Silent Hill. It's basically everything in a lot of Japanese. And horror. look, they spoiled a monster Hello? reveal in the Hello? fucking loading screen. You believe I, that I shit? I actually didn't look at it. 